Okay, YouTube, so I'm at home, and I'm bored, and I'm like, <laughs> I got all this stuff to play with, so why not make a video, right? So, I want to go through this box of minis, okay? I want to go through this box of minis. So, unfortunately, this is only like, this is, this is like two-thirds of my mini haul collection. I have like another third in the tub over there, and I'm not going to pull that out. And if it makes you feel any better, it's all a thousand wishes stuff anyway. So I can push, but yeah. So this is like two, but this right here collectively is like two thirds of my collection. So we just don't go through this box. So I don't know about y'all, but when I go into Bath and Body Works, right, and I smell stuff, like I don't really use the little cards. What I do is I put smells on different patches of my skin, so I know. Um, so I know by the time I leave, I'll be smelling crazy. And the funny thing is, um. The funny thing is, like, I'm good with, like, like, I, like if you could you could tell me something, I can forget it. But if I see it, I'll remember it. So I can remember what each bottle, what color the bottle was that I sprayed where, right? And I usually do that because if I can still smell something after an hour, then that's usually one that I will put into my, ooh, I got to have list. Um, and as long as there's no alcohol, as long as there's no alcohol flashback, I'll grab it. But... If there's no alcohol flashback when I first put it on and it still lasts for like an hour or more on me, then it definitely goes like my number one gotta have it next time I'm in store or order it that night, basically. So, we're gonna jump into this box. So, my first little mini was Ghoul Friend. And I got Ghoul Friend this year, Miss. I got this when they first came out this Halloween season. Because for one, I love Ghoul Friend. I have the Ghoul Friend candle. I got two Ghoul Friend candles, right? I haven't even used them. But I love the way it smells. It, it kind of remind me of like a grape smell for some reason, right? The only thing is, you know, I didn't, I don't, I didn't like, I don't like the silver shimmer. I kind of like gold flake shimmer. I'm really not into so much the silver shimmer, but this smells really good and it has a really strong scent. Like I said, this is something that I would either wear like for a date night type of thing or for one to a pool party type of thing or something that just would evolve around me needing glitter but it smells so good it smells like lifesavers and jolly ranchers like this one i really like the, the ghoul friend shimmer it smells so good i wish they would have just had like a ghoul friend um body spray if y'all know what the dupe is let me know but like just this is a body spray with no shimmer mm, but it's totally been awesome so i love ghoul friend um what's the notes in ghoul friend oh you know what i'm gonna go ahead and read the candle <laughs> this is right here so the notes in ghoul, ghoul friend are Dark strawberries, ghostly... Oh, peony! Y'all know what? I'm gonna grab me some more of these next time I go in the store because I only have one. I'm sorry. Ghostly peony, spill challenge citrus with natural essential oils. Now, if y'all know me, y'all know I love peony. Anything with peony in it, I will dive in. So now I gotta go get more of these. I'm so mad. They just had a mini sale and I didn't get no more. And see, that's why you gotta go... You gotta turn over your collection every now and then. You got... Because your, your, your palette... Yo, yo, sensual, your scent, chewal palette changes all the time. And now, because these has peony in it, I want to grab more of them. <laughs> okay, so. Oh, next. This right here, we can go through this. The Thousand Wishes Hand Antibacterial Spray. Now, I got this during SAS, so these were $1.63 a piece. So, I grabbed a lot of these. And I actually use these. These are in my everyday bag. I spray this a lot. When I go out to eat, when I got the kids with me, if I got my boo with me, everybody can spray their hands real quick. Let's eat. Or if we come in from the parks, so everybody spray their hands. Like, this comes in so handy. And this one is not too overwhelming. It's a good little scent. It doesn't really linger long. So, if you know a last a last or longing antibacterial hand spray, let, let me know. Um... I do want to get the, I believe this comes in champagne, apple, and honey, and I do want to get one of those. There actually is a $2.95 sale going on right now, so I may um, grab one just for my, you know, just for my test purposes, but this is a must-have in your bag. This is an easy go-to, very easy to do alcohol spray thing, okay? So, um, oh, I got me a champagne toast, right? Champagne toast and champagne toast. I think champagne, it don't have the, um, the ingredients they on here. I have a champagne toast candle, but for, oh, it's all packed up back there somewhere. It ain't grabbable, so I ain't about to, but I will do champagne. No, champagne toast has sparkling champagnes and berries or something. I don't think it has peony, but anyway, this is my small little champagne toast. I love me some champagne toast. So like what I'm about to do now is what I'll do in store. I'll just start going up my arm, spraying different stuff. Yeah, yeah, I, I believe Champagne Toast has, it's either because of the sparkling champagne 
But it gives like a, like a twist of uh, citrus in here. Anyways, I love champagne towels. That's one of my ones, my day ones. Um, oh, sweater weather. Yeah, I just recently picked this up at the... Um, they just had the little uh, 395 mini sale. So I picked up sweater weather because I liked it because there was no flashback when I first spray it. And it just, it smells so good to me. Sweater weather, as a matter of fact, I love sweater weather so much. When I got from this, I ended up just getting the set of sweater weather. I know that's like not part of the mini haul, but I really love, this is like, this is a cozy, like when you put on a sweater and a hat and a belt and some boots and you just lather yourself in this, you just smell like fall and you feel like fall. This sweater weather really is, it's actually really named appropriately. I really like this one. This one gonna get a lot of use this fall and winter. I love sweater weather. I'm definitely gonna grab some more of the body mist of sweater weather. Um, so yeah, sweater weather smells so good. It's like a delicious, it's not a warm tone, but it's just like a delicious, subtle, it like, it's, it starts off subtle and then it like sneaks up on you. That's what sweater weather does on my skin. So I really love sweater weather. Okay, so the next is, Fall in Bloom. I did get this when they just had the three ninety five um thing. I actually got a Fall in Bloom candle too, so we can say with the notes or in here. Let me wait, cause I, I got the lotion too, but I don't think there you go. So the candle, yeah, the candle is right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read the candle so we can see what's the ingredients in Fall in Bloom. So it's my Fall in Bloom candle. So the ingredients. Oh, I like the copper top too. It's sweet. Fall in Bloom is Juicy Plum, Wild Blooms, oh, Velvet Moss. Yeah, that's what attracted me to this spray. The Velvet Moss in this spray, it really, let me see. Okay. I <laughs> see, now this, mm, sweater weather. Out of all, like, like how, um, the girlfriend was sweet. The, um, the sweater weather is more like cozy, homey smell. Okay, so Fall in Bloom. Oh, I remember Fall in Bloom. I can remember when I first, it does. It reminds me of, have you ever been to a swamp? And you know how you can smell like the, the mossy, wet grass, but not a dewy smell, but it's more, it's like a mossy smell, like you would know. Like that's how, how falling, that velvety moss, that's what this smells. This reminds me of like going through a, a swamp with like a floral scent on top. That's like, but not in a bad way because I'm a water sign. I'm Pisces and I like water, lakes, cabin, right? So being in a mossy swamp is still giving me some type of comfort because I know it's deep waters right there, but. So, yeah, Fall in Bloom is going. However, the Fall in Bloom lotion, for all the purpose, I ain't even about to put none on. But I tried some of this on in the store, and baby, it smelled like Bucci. Okay? It smelled like Bucci. Just Google Bucci, and then you're going to know what Bucci is. But I still got it because I wanted to just have a little pair. Um, Maybe if they re... Oh, I know I said, maybe if they reformulate Fall in Bloom, I can get more lotion. Or I said I was going to try to, um, I said I was going to add some peppermint oil to some of it and see how it came out. I still have to do that. I should have did that before this video, so I got to help y'all. But I'm going to do a video on me trying to mix this into a lotion I could actually like. But I still got it for all intents and purposes. It has the shea butter. No cocoa butter. But it has the hyaluronic acid. It is. This is a 24-hour moisture cream, too, so... Fall in Bloom. Let me know how y'all feel about the Fall in Bloom lotion. So, in here, we got more of my uh, Thousand Wishes hand spray. We, this one was $1.63, so I got a lot of those. I also had got this during SAS. Um, and these were $1.63 as well. The Travel a Thousand Wishes. I mean, really ain't too much I need to even say about a Thousand Wishes. Just know it's got peonies in it. Okay? And on this channel, <laughs> I'm about to start counting how many times I'll say peony because I love peonies i love that smell mm, okay so that's my thousand wishes mini spray what else we got in this box oh pure wonder i older but goody i older i oldie but goody pure wonder so pure wonder right pure wonder pure wonder i was afraid of pure wonder at first because i don't know why but i'm like dang the packaging look like an old lady then i'm like okay then look christmas like i went through the whole package today so then i'm like you know what let me just see what Pure Wonder got to do, right? So, first of all, there was no flashback. And secondly, it reminds me of a perfume. If you know the dupe, go ahead and let me know. But it definitely is a, is a, is a, it kind of reminds me of Enchanted Cotton Candy or the Ariana Grande um, pink one, the, the, the sugar, I got it over this one. It kind of reminds me of that one. It's, but, but it's, but it's like, 
but not overwhelming. It turns from like the candy to a like a plum or like a, a berry or something like that. But it still gives perfume. This is a date night, definitely. This is you, so you can wear this on date night. You can wear this on expensive, just dress expensive and put on and slather yourself in some pure wonder. Keep this in your purse. It's definitely an expensive dupe smell. I love pure wonder. So what else we got up in here? More um hand sanitizer spray. I can't get enough of them. Oh yeah, sweet whiskey. So I did get sweet whiskey. Now this is a newer scent. Well, they were well, not new, but they reinvented it. But um, new packaging and everything. So um, sweet whiskey. Um, so you know, I'm sort of kind of a fan, right? So I got it because it was new in store and I tried it, and. It didn't give me no alcohol flashback, right? So I was like, "Oh, good." And then it's like, for some reason, I guess it's maybe the whiskey or whatever, but something makes me feel like it gives me like a like a. You ever had like roasted nuts, like roasted nuts, like over an open fire, like that's what this smell like to me. It smelled like roasted nuts in a freaking. But I guess they couldn't like roasted nuts, but like you know how you can dip them in like a bourbon or dip them in um, Jack Daniels, right? That's what sweet whiskey reminds me of. It's very, it's a, it is, it's a holiday scent to me. Uh, to me, Sweet Whiskey is a holiday scent, and I definitely will be wearing that this holiday. Um, so I did got some hand creams up in this box. Some of these I bought when they were one ninety five. Some I bought when they were through two ninety five. Um, this is Sunrise Woods. I'm not really a fan of Sunrise Woods, but this was in store when they were one ninety five. So I just went ahead and grabbed it. Um. Dahlia, this was a dollar. I got this at the outlet that I go to, the Dahlia hand cream. And I wish I would have um, grabbed more, but I didn't. But Dahlia reminds me of, it reminds me of um, <coughs> Midnight Bloom and Jasmine. It definitely puts me along those lines when I smell it. So I really like it. This is a soft after, like after bath type of lotion for me, Dahlia. Um, oh, champagne apple and honey. Y'all know I love champagne apple and honey. This is a romantic day night, dinner night, um, you know, self-care night lotion. Definitely champagne apple and honey. You can't go wrong with that. Um, so I just got some more champagne apple and honeys in my box or whatever. Um, uh, what's that? Oh, thought it was coming out. Okay. Oh, I do. I got a butterfly hand sanitizer. I love these two. I love these give off more aroma to me than the sprays do, of course. I guess because the way they come out and the consistency, but these definitely are good. Um, Leaves is my all time favorite pocket bag, and it has the strongest. This and lavender vanilla have the strongest um, throw for me when you use them as a hand sanitizer. So those are my two top two for throw. Um, here's Poppy. Um, I actually keep a poppy on my nightstand. You can't see it, but so at night when I just quick hand sanitizer, I'll use poppy. This is right there. Oh, this one I got in store because it's just so funny to me. This is Ho Ho Ho. It was last year's um, <laughs> collection. It just feels like a really fresh. This is a fresh smell. Ho Ho is a really fresh smell. Um, I wish they had more to that collection. And of course, I got my thousand wishes. You know, I can't go wrong with anything that has peonies in it. So, I mean, most of my, my pocket bags I got for $1.95 or I got them for a dollar when they were on sale. But I don't mind paying two bucks if I really, really want one. Um, so, what else? So, I got some more the Thousand Wishes sprays I had got during SAS up in my box, right? And um, I got a Champagne Apple and Honey spray. And then, of course, I got my You're the One sprays that I just manifested, right? Because these have been sold out and gone. Then I walked into the store the other day, and there were four available to buy. So I did the buy three, get one free. And then, last but not least, in my, well, not all, well, second to last, but definitely not least, my You're the One lotion. I love these for my purses when I'm going out. And I want to just, you know, out with my babe. I want to make sure he got that scent going so he can know what time it is. Okay. But last but not least, I also have in here my pocket bag holders. So I had got, I had got the gold one to go with leaves, right? And then with the blue one, I was saying I could do poppy with the blue pocket bag, or I could do ocean because I do got an ocean hand sanitizer. I had got for my bullet. Hopefully he get it and I don't use it. <laughs> 
Okay, so that basically was my little box of minis, y'all. I just wanted to go through real quick and let y'all see half of, like, basically half of my mini collection because I still have a lot more to it, but I don't want to, all of it won't even fit in this one box anyway. I got to find a way to organize all my stuff, y'all. Okay, so I'm going to talk to y'all later, YouTube. Bye. <laughs>